damn it. Okay. Then Lime Meadow, I should go to the lift. Thank you, Beyonce. To the lift, to the lift. Oh, man. On my Spidey bike, I jump on my tush. On the Spidey bike. Yes. Spidey bike? Yeah, because it's red and blue. Um, it could be a Superman bike. Yeah, every time, every time I say... Sp <laughs> Every time I say Spider-Man, I thought I see something red and blue. I always think, well, it also could be Superman, but bump Superman. Yeah, Spider-Man's cooler. For me, that's so kind. Yeah, you know it. That's so kind. Yeah. Actually, these are from oldest, but they're really from me. Poison, he's... Yeah, even though I went and did the work. Even Otis. though your friend is asleep, so th does your friend just smell Otis when he comes around? Is Does Otis not bathe? Has he been hanging out with the pigs too long? I think, you know what, I think she likes those and that's why she's being a other blocker. Don't block the other, don't swap the other. Don't swap my other girl. It's sensitive. I don't wait for me, you for me, 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 me. Okay. Can you meet your me, 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 me? Sure, even though we all have cell phones. Where, where's where's it like crash and burn my bike? There it is. <laughs> it's like where did I crash? Where did I leave my my bike? Oh, it's over there with that pot of like the pool of blood from right. my head wound. <laughs> pool of blood and milk. And milk. Ugh. Oh, that'd be like a really gritty like graphic novel set in this universe called Blood and Milk. Ooh. We're like Some, somebody write that. Otis like is a chain smoker. And he's like a private eye. <laughs> and like you watch him like brutalize a pig and like beat him up. And he's like, give me the information I'm looking for. Like hitting him with his hooves. And he takes a big like drag from his cigarette. And he's like, pfft. I think we'll say and he blows it in his face. How you gonna say it took a huge dump? Yeah, that too. <laughs> How did it go? Pretty good, I reckon. She really liked them and asked me to thank you personally. Tell you what, here's my metal detector. Sick. Why do you need that? It's good fun using this to find things around the farm. Like metal? Yeah, things like metal. Take it, it's yours. Neat. Later. Yeah, I love how your response is just neat. Yeah, thanks. I really, yeah. I'd rather have some cash, you know, because I kind of went and picked the flowers for you and then, you know, brought them to the girl for you. You know, maybe I'm going to ask the girl out instead. You know? I should have. When you are close to treasure, the green ring will pulse quickly. Once you oh, find something, boy. the ring will pulse red. So basically, okay. this is another reason for you to slow down the gameplay and walk around slowly well, you know. and look for things monotonously. Maybe. Maybe you get big mega bucks for doing this. When you are finished... It's probably going to be like one coin at a time, Darren. Press, press Y. Well, someone's hitting me up and I see who's hitting me up. I'm going to go back out to that field and use it. Yeah. Okay. Duke, it's too late to apologize. It's too late. See you tomorrow. Uh, oh, Freddy. Ew. That is the worst picture out of all of them. Just imagine getting a uh, FaceTime call and looking uh, at that's That's what's waiting on you on the other side. Yeah, no, the sun's not. going down. I'll text you again in the morning. But this is the first time you're texting me. Yeah, I know. So you let me know I'm too late to do something after you should have probably said, hey, meet me now. See, they're just trying to calm you down. They're just like, the sun's getting real low. I'm not the Hulk. The sun's getting real low. Oh, no. Go, oh. Get away from me, person who doesn't Didn't deserve. Didn't Deadpool make that joke? Get, get away from me, really? person who doesn't deserve a movie. Do what? I said, get away from me, person who doesn't deserve a movie. Yeah. I think I, oh, I think I saw a rock. I'm getting really excited for these rocks because I haven't found one in a while. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. There we go. Yeah, that's the most efficient way to turn around. Yeah, you know it. Yeah, like it, I don't think the Hulk really does merit a full movie. The Hulk. I'm talking about Black Widow. Oh, oh, yeah, that too. Like, I think the Hulk, like, just has a hard time being very interesting, because even his cartoon was boring. 
Yeah, it's all cartoon. Yeah, like back in the 90s. Huh. It, it just wasn't, like... It, it's hard to build something around somebody who can basically is invincible. Like, kind of like Superman, but Superman's cartoon was good. Yeah, Superman's cartoon, well, that's because Bruce Timm worked on it. And Paul Dini and all them dudes. All them legendary DC animated universe dudes worked on it. And, you know, like, most of what they've done has been really good. You know, like, Justice League Unlimited and, like, Batman the Animated Series. Batman Beyond. Um, yeah. D- I give DC a lot of gruff, but when it comes to the animated stuff, it's always top notch. Oh, yeah, like, especially, like, Young Justice. Like, yeah. That's not, like, a Bruce Timm bald anything, but Young Justice is top tier animation. Like, for sure. Like, it, I think it was really, like, one of the last great cartoons on Cartoon Network that wasn't just all goofy, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> that wasn't just Teen Titans Go Teen Titans Go and Gumball which I like Gumball but I mean that's the only two shows you're gonna show Teen Titans Go and Gumball real talk Cartoon Network has like five shows and they show like reruns of all of them <laughs> they show one the whole day all day so Gumball's Monday Teen Titans Go Tuesday and then that's probably the rest of the week just alternating like, what happened to good animated shows, man? Like, seriously. Like, it feels like everything good either ends too soon, gets canceled, or gets a crappy sequel. You know? And that ruins it for you. <laughs> like, I mean... Uh, there's just so many good shows. Like, um, like, Young Justice got canceled after two seasons for dumb reasons and finally got brought back. And it's pretty good, season three is. Uh, the parts I've seen of it, I haven't watched all of it yet, but it's been it's been very good. I've been very is it exclusive uh, on that DC thing. Yeah, it is, and it's it's really cool. And it, like since it's on that DC thing, they have a lot more leeway, so they don't have to worry about like Cartoon Network standards. So it's it's a little more violent, and you know, there's a uh, what uh, can of beans, oh, tin can, amazing. I'll give it one more game. My God. Yeah. Uh, anyways. But yeah, it's a little more violent. It's uh, got some got some blood in it. Uh, some implied uh, some implied sexual intercourse in it. It's yeah, pretty good. It's re- not it's really not over the top though. It's not F Batman or anything like I, that. I really want these animated teenagers to be having sex. Oh, not the teenagers. Off, off screen. No, it's not like the teenagers. It's like, like some of the other characters, like, you know, like Black Lightning. Anyways, um, wait. So, this is a Teen Titans where uh, well, Static Shock's already an adult. No, um, this is like a Teen Titans show that's about like Teen Titans, and then like ah. some of them are grown up because they grew up in the Teen Titans and they've already grown up. Like Robin's Nightwing in it now. He started off as Robin in the first season, but then in season two they had a time jump, and then you know Dick Grayson became Nightwing, and now there's Tim Drake Robin, and uh-huh. Jason Todd died in between seasons. Quote cool, unquote that. Yeah. Anyways, I'm not gonna say too much because that show's great. You should totally go watch it if uh, you like cartoons that are not just goofy. If you like action cartoons and. Things with progressing plots and ongoing stories. Uh, it's great. It's really it's really top tier animation. It's part like one of my favorites. Uh, it's up there with like Avatar: The Last Airbender. Uh, really, really good. Like man, Last Airbender was and is a masterpiece. Mm-hmm. When was the last time you watched that Last Airbender? Have you ever watched it all the way through? No, nah, but I do have the. Uh... <sighs> The series on DVD. I own the whole thing. Me and my I need wife. Need to watch it. Me, me and my wife watched the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that was great. Me and my wife watched the whole yeah, thing sure. together. Uh, over. Actually, we watched it in like a week. We watched the whole thing in a week. That's what we did. Like every night, we'd get home from work or whatever, and we'd be like, "Hey, you want to watch some Avatar?" And it's like, "Yeah, let's watch Avatar." And we'd watch like four or five episodes. <laughs> mm-hmm. Uh. And we'd be sitting there like, what in the morning? Like, oh yeah, we should probably go to sleep. 
Sleep is probably be good if you're planning on getting up early for to, work. You know, for work. If you gotta work for a living, then yeah, sleep's good. But uh, oh man, almost. <laughs> um, I'm just looking for ways to just break just this break, game. Just now. break it, man. Just break it. After we're done. Looks like he just ripped the fat one. <laughs> he <kinda Ooh>. <laughs> he's like, that's, he's like, oh god, he fell so hard he farted. You ever, you ever had the fart, but you held it in because you was like around people, but then I was like, hey, can you pick that TV up for me? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you bend down to get it on the way up, and the fart you was trying to save from everybody just had to come out. I, I've had, yeah, I've had those moments. I hate, when, I hate when that happens. It's the worst. It is the worst. And then, but it's your fault for standing around me. You could have went away. You didn't have to be it's here like, for this. I could pick up this TV without you watching. Yeah, it's like you the one that asked me to pick this thing up. This is your fault. All I right. was trying to save y'all, but then y'all had to um, ask me for favors. Did I? Did my phone go off? Had to ask me for ish. All right. Should I do creepy guy or do? I just uh, do the creepy guy. Just get out of the way. I don't want to see that face on the phone anymore. Creepy Freddy. Here we come. Yeah, creepy Freddy. Uh. All right. What's up, creep? Bonus wait me. Oh god. Bonus wait me. Bonus. I'm sorry, where was I? Uh, he sounds like uh, Chief Irons. Mm. Uh, <laughs> he sounds a lot like Chief Irons there, huh? You were right here, Freddy. Oh, he was. Mm. Look, I gotta tell you, I'm hungry. I mean, really hungry. I don't even understand what this guy's supposed to be. A ferret. Really? I think so. Do ferrets eat eggs and chickens? I think they're omnivores, so they eat meat and stuff. Oh, okay. I mean, I am so, so hungry. You would not believe how- Oh my god, shut up about how hungry you are. Just... I bet you'll be so hungry. I think I get the point, nerd. I need something healthy, something fresh, something ve some vegetables, yes, that's it. Some vegetables, huh? Please, please, can you bring me a carrot from Cabbage and Pumpkin right now? Carrot, cabbage, and a pumpkin. Well, I'm pretty sure all that's in the vegetable thing. Yeah. If I don't eat this, I don't know what I'll do! So this is what he does, he's like, curbs his weird appetite and urges by eating vegetables all day? I guess. Alright. Uh, Wait a minute. Like twitch for a second. So, usually when you miss a mission, it says, hey, just hit me up tomorrow. But he's hurting right now to eat some of these chickens. What if the chickens disappear tomorrow? What if I just let this time run out? I doubt that will happen. You think they put that much thought into this? I, I would hope. Doubt. I will hope. Well, I go through that whole little spiel of whatever that was and not to do it. Doing? What am I doing? Hmm. I kind of want the time to run out and see what happens. <laughs> Nothing's gonna happen, Daryl. I can already tell you. <sighs> Are you hungry? <laughs> oh, uh, just asking. Are you hungry? I'm hungry. Why is everybody hungry? It's making me hungry. You just ate. I don't care. One more. Why is this moving at 60 frames? <laughs> I know! <laughs> it looks so weird when that happens. Alright, I'm trying to make the fudge. I don't know if I have any butter though. Strawberry, strawberry. Yeah, this is. I want a cream make, man. I have no butter. Cream. I'm gonna put cream on. I'm baking! I don't like how dishy it sounds, man. Oh, no good! Ah, <laughs> oh, I got schlops. Not that bad. Mm. Yeah, pretty good. I think I'll go get a snack. So you're eating my schlop? Yeah, you can keep that schlop. You can keep it you already put your tongue in it. Ugh. <laughs> Did you say ugh like that? <laughs> no, I was just thinking about the uh, the noise that the honey patch made. You remember the... Oh, yeah, I forgot yeah. about that. And like, yeah, it, the schlop, and you talk about putting your tongue in it, made me think about that, like, oh, the... Ugh. 
That was the grossest noise I think I've ever heard in a game. And I've played... Jeez, that was oh brutal. God. <laughs> but, you know, like... I think that's the grossest noise I've ever heard in a game, and I've played Dead Space, so... That game is just full of stomping and gore and... And MKX. Like, MKX didn't gross me out as much as that honey noise. That was that was straight up nasty. Speaking, speaking of MKX, how, how are you feeling about MK11? You, you hyped for it? You looking forward to it? Uh, I don't know, man. Like, I used to play... Like, man, MKX was... The ish whenever I had friends over. But, like, right now it's just, like... You and me. No offense, but like most of the time we're playing to record, so we don't do like a lot of uh, like playing like games like that, like MKX or anything like that. It's like a fun party game, but like I I'm not that into fighting games to be like, oh yeah, this is you know what I'm super into. So you play with friends? You don't like play it on your own? Right? No, I play with friends and just yeah, no. It'd be like, like, for me, it's like playing Gang Beasts by yourself. Like, what's the point? Like, you don't play Gang Beasts by yourself? Um, I don't think I have. Exactly. Like, it's not as fun, you know? Mm. It's more fun having somebody there. Oh, there's a thing in there. Oh. What we got? Strawberry Shake. Still know where to get ice, though. Uh, that's weird. I bet you can go rob a convenience store. Yeah, probably. You put a ski mask over your udder and grab a gun. <laughs> you don't, don't put it over your face. <laughs> no. Just your udder. But put some holes in it so you Stick them up! <laughs> put some holes in it so you can squirt out of it. Yeah. Oh god, whatever you do, don't squirt me! Take whatever you want! Gladly. And as they leave, it's just I was gonna say, I'm just gonna take you. Anyways. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that got weird. Man, uh, I, I, like, MK11 looks cool, I guess. It's got time travel. It's like, ah, uh, it's MK. It's fun. It's goofy. It's it's over the top. It, I don't know. It's not like... Like, fighting games have never been my favorite. They've just, like I said, they've just been a fun thing to do, like, with friends around. Like, I'm not, like if I got a choice between playing, like, Gang Beasts or MK, I'd probably play Gang Beasts. Because Gang Beast is just, it's just fun. Like, every time we play, I laugh till I cry. Did, did you, uh, I, did, I told you about you can get the physical copies now, right? I need to, need to look into that. It's only 30 bucks. Yeah, I haven't. I don't know about shipping and handling, but. Yeah, I, I ain't bought a, bought a game in a while. I might, might see if I can grab some Gang Beasts and maybe we could do a Battle Royale here on the channel. What I don't like about the physical copy thing, though, is, Whoa. yeah, this is dumb. Is that um? What the heck? Who's cussing me out? <laughs> the pig? I think so. Um, is that it, it can come in four different colors? The disc, either red, blue, green, or yellow. Uh huh. But it's random. I want red. I mean, yeah, I would want red or blue, but. So I gotta just get lucky on the draw. Yeah, like I would want red or blue, but I'm not. I'm not gonna get that annoyed about it if I get like yellow. You know, cause if I get yellow, I would be annoyed. I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm not gonna be looking at the disc. You know. I, want red. I mean, I feel you, but I want the red popsicle. Nah, I want the orange pops. If it's a popsicle, I want orange. I, you know, cause like I don't like I like cherry stuff, but most of the time, like when it comes to like flavored candies, I'd rather have like. Uh, orange. I gotta choose between like red or other colors. Here you go. go. Okay, I was gonna see there'd be another bite in there. And that's good. All right. Nice fresh vegetables. That's right, vegetables. Ew. Not baby chicks. Shouldn't eat, baby. Maybe just one. So you're good now, yai? You gooch? Couldn't be better. <laughs> See ya. That might be what's wrong with this guy is that he's deprived of meat and protein. That's why he's so jumpy and weird. What are you looking up? What are you looking at, Daryl? I'm trying to see what the heck he is. 